Okay, we are back. We are going into the garage. If, if you did not catch the last episode uh, or last series where we did the Holiday House, make sure you go over to the playlist and uh, watch that series first. Uh, now we are going to be heading in to the the like, car dealership machine rental place here, and we got to pick up some machines to do this next job, which we are doing a road. Okay, gee. First things first, we need the layer that lays the pavement. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, shoot. No, I don't want. I wanted this one. I wanted the caterpillar one. Oh, well. I guess we're that's what we're doing. Okay, this one is for ripping up the old cement. We've already got a roller, and we are going to need a cement truck to bring cement. Okay, here we go. We're going to need that, so let's get that rented. Okay, now. Whoa, wait a minute, why is that there? That's not good. I didn't rent that. I thought I was renting. Wasn't there a picture of the cement layer? Or the asphalt layer? When I hit rent? That's weird. Okay, well, now we just rented a machine that we didn't need. At least we were able to return it right away, so it wasn't like it cost us a ton of money. Oh, the other thing I have not done. Uh, let's take a look and see our upgrades. Is there anything that we can upgrade? They're all unlocked, unlocked. Contracts. Complete the expansion contract from the opening campaign to complete the S. Oh, so I've got to finish that. Uh, this is the final mission to complete all the tasks for the level. Okay. Um, yeah, so I, I need to finish that first. Uh, currently we're doing this harbor road. So I don't have any, oh wait a minute, skills. Maybe I can upgrade something. We do have two upgrade points. Um, good business sense, wear, fuel, crane speed, fitness, asphalt capacity, bulk, bucket capacity. Material capacity. Asphalt capacity. Let's do that one. Because we're using, we're doing a lot of um, cement laying and stuff like that. So, okay, now we are back here. Let's run in there and get the machine that I actually was trying to rent the first time around. And that will be. And now we can actually get the one I wanted. Okay, we gotta get this stuff over to the job site. And the job site is where? Right there, okay. It's nice that we had already kind of went down there before, because that way we can just fast travel here. So it's road is must be what we're let's get this off out of the way okay now we gotta get back up here yes that would be 
what, that'd be quite the drive. If I had to, especially that, I would have to get it up on a flatbed. I'll pay that a little bit extra money to get it transported. Okay, now we gotta get the one to tear up the cement. This would be another one we would have to have a flatbed to get it down to the job site. Yeah, I could do the whole phase. I don't know if anybody would want to watch that though. Because that would be really, like, really time consuming.
right now. So let's head back. Whoops. Well, I guess if I just went here, because I'm going to be returning it to the main lot and I need to be at my facility to be able to do that. So we'll run in here. But yeah, I was trying, I was saying, uh, but I didn't want to talk too much with the machine running, but yeah, hopefully everybody's doing well. Uh, yeah, yesterday I was, my plan for the day was to get um, three videos done in the morning when I first got up. I was like, okay, I'm going to get three videos done. And then I was like, well, and then I got to do dishes. So I, I went out and I kind of rearranged the dishes in the sink and stuff and the water wasn't flowing down. So I was like, oh shoot, water's not flowing, so it's like it's plugged. So I, I got my, I got this uh, pump up plunger thing where you pump up water, air pressure, and blow it up. That didn't work. It blew the pipe off, <laughs> off the bottom of the sink, because um, I was doing it in the secondary sink, which there's a straight, a line that goes straight over. So, I had to run into town to get new um, sink pipes, which I need to change in many ways. Um, I got those and then I found out the drain pipe was all rusted out so that it was leaking. I couldn't get it back together because it was broke apart. 
So that kind of killed that, um, <laughs> that part of the job. And then I also realized that the plug wasn't at the sink P-trap anymore, it was at the catch in the, um, in the basement. So, I went on this morning and ordered all the tools and stuff that I'm going to need to be able to, um, remove and clean the trap in the basement, which is going to be interesting. Never tried that seat. My dad did it in Illinois. So I watched him do it there. This will be my first time trying to clean the trap myself. I could get a plumber, but, you know, the cost for the tools is a whole lot less than the cost to have somebody come out and do it. When all I needed was the tools to be able to do it, because basically if it can be done, I can figure it out. I'll, I'll get it done at some point. Just takes a little bit longer because you're learning how to do it. So that stuff will be here on Monday, so I might not get. I'll try to get as many videos done on Sunday, so I have videos Monday, but there might be a shortage of videos on Tuesday, depending on how long it takes me to do all this plumbing work.
I don't actually need the blacktop. Can I just refill it? I hope not. Uh, I thought we had to use the blacktop truck. I guess it's more convenient, not this realistic. money on it don't take it back to the actual rental place take it back to your shop because that's where you have to be to return it anyways so save your save your time going it would be nice if you could just go and return it and you might be able to I just I, this seemed to be the easiest way to do it so because you have to do it from your garage oh I didn't need this either Okay, now we need this. We have to compact it. Yeah, see, now we're not spending as much money on the, the rental if you get them returned right away once you're done using them. Okay, now let's get some lights on. It's still dark, which would be nice if it would get to be daylight pretty quick here. Okay. 
There we go.
talk to the foreman. Oh, let's get those lights off. Screenshot of our road that we finished. Sweet. Okay. Let's go talk to the foreman. see what this place is. Actually, I don't know. Should we? Is that a gas station? What is that over there? <laughs> well, we're gonna drive over there in this. It'll take a little bit longer. It's a bit older, but well, a compactor. But I want to get over there and see what that building is, so that gives us another place to jump to. And I don't know if we unlock, like, finding, like, buildings, if that, uh, or if should I just drive on the sidewalk? What? Wait, what? I backed up. Why did I get a fine if I backed up? Here's where you will manufacture manufacture steel good for active jobs. If you accept the multiple job parallel, make sure the job which you want to pick up steel goods marked on the active job. You can find more information about the job menu. Good goods from steel mill are made available to pick up. Okay. Just want to see what Okay, so I don't know if I'm going to need steel for these things, or what? I don't know. Okay, well, let's head back to our... Head back to our shop. Yeah, I guess there's still a couple more places around here that I haven't seen. I could grab one. You know, they do sell, like, a car, I think. I don't know if it, it might be in the DLC. I don't know if we have the car yet. Because I know there's a DLC that I haven't bought yet. Okay, well, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed the episode, getting that road work done. Let's get this thing stored so it can start getting fixed up on. Um, let's take a look at our company um, vehicle fleet. We got those. We got the warehouse, which we have nothing in there right now. Um, I don't know why I would. 
you know, that's not really, I think this is probably where they drop it here if I want, and I can move the materials from here. Um, level ups, so I still need to do that. I might do this expansion contract. And I think that's probably under the campaign. So maybe we'll do this next. We'll work some more on the campaign or something. I don't actually, let's see. Okay. Yeah, so we've got, um, we got to do some more of these expansion. Okay. Um, next episode, we will start work on this expansion. So be sure to be um, a subscriber. Get that bell icon hit so you know when the next video is coming out. We'll be doing all different kind of jobs. Um, thank you so much, Heather and Chris, for being channel members. If anybody else is interested in becoming a channel member, um, I have two tiers. We have the your um, the, the lower tier, which you get a um, icon next to your uh, name. You get your name mentioned in the videos and in the description. And then we have a tire tier, which is uh, the your awesome level. You get all the videos that are released a day after being filmed. You get them the day they're filmed, so you get them a day early. Um, plus, you get exclusive videos. I've got uh, some different videos that are exclusive, which you will get a chance to say uh, what video you might want as an exclusive video. Okay, well, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Have a great rest of your day.